<laughs> no, 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 no. Please, please don't. Don't stop. Y you don't mean it. Look, I got one more for you. A guy goes to the doctor and the doctor says, you got six months to live. And the guy says, but doctor, it'll take me longer than that to pay your bill. And the doctor says, all right, nine months. <laughs> thank you, thank you. One more, one more. A patient goes to the doctor and the doctor says, I have very bad news for you. You only have two weeks to live. And the patient says, but doctor, I feel fine. Do you mind if I get a second opinion? And the doctor says, not at all. You're ugly too. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Did you hear the one about the three-legged... Yeah, who's there? I got a delivery for Joe Tyson. I'm Joe Tyson. What you got? Strawberry. Fantastic. You waiting on a tip? Well, it ain't unheard of. Old villain in the fort at Hialeah. <laughs> Urgent. Need more on post office box 3411A. Current business dealings. Enemies. Anything. Everything. Huh. choice frying pan or fire your agent your partner both steaming staying true to the cliche i think i'll go from the frying pan into the fire nick alas we've got artwork to go over two minutes my darling i have some business to take care of with eden nice outfit <laughs> business huh well, those two, oil and water. Believe me, Mike, I know. <laughs> Your message last night was a lie. You do still need me. I needed you more last night. Love? Lust. Distraction. 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 That's good. I like our relationship just the way it is. Yeah, I know. That's where you get two men for the price of one. And you don't have to make a commitment to either one of us. Well, I might consider Nicholas Fleming. You can stop running around playing John Sable. I am John Sable. I play Nicholas Fleming. Don't forget it. Hey, I'm asking for a little bit of credit. If it weren't for me and Nicholas Fleming, you'd still be hiding out in some $2 hotel picking up odd jobs. Don't forget that. You always like to throw that in. It's because it's true. If it weren't for me creating Nicholas Fleming, you probably would be dead. And so would they. Kids really like these stories. I was with this guy last night. And his granddaughter was kidnapped. Maybe, I don't know, maybe 
Just me. Listen to you. You said I had two minutes, Nick. Polite people use full, proper names. And they knock. I've been waiting for you to approve this artwork. It has to go out. That's an interesting outfit, Mike. Oh. Do you think so? Yeah. You auditioning for a show later? I'm into the flapper look, Eden. <laughs> no. Well, I hear it's coming back. Yeah. For those of us who weren't around the first time. It's a much freer look. Don't you think so, Nicholas? Uh-huh. You got a passing mark. Passing mark. That's it. Your hat gets a passing mark, too. Ha-ha. <laughs> Yeah, they are, aren't they? And to quote ZZ Top, she knows how to use them. John. Hey. I'm really sorry. So much to do and so little time. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> You're right. Nicholas Fleming is important to me. So is John Sable. We have deadlines to meet. I'll make it. First, I got to take care of this guy. You think you'll ever overcome your guilt? If I did, I wouldn't be dangerous enough. You get bored. Probably. start using doors like regular folks do. Oh. <laughs> One day I'm gonna get you cheesecake. Uh. Someday I'm gonna catch you napping. Oh, yeah, get real, John. Hey, did you oh. hear the one about the guy who goes into a bar with a parrot? Heard it. What you got? How about the one about the three-legged horse? Heard it. All right. What about the one about the big-time toy manufacturer who's so clean he makes Princess Die look like a porno queen? Now, I checked into some of the best data banks going, man, and Zippo Dirt. This guy doesn't even have a parking ticket. No bad press, pays his bills, pays his taxes. Now, what the hell would a guy like that want to get mixed up with the likes of you for? Someone wants him dead. Kidnapped his granddaughter. Told him to kill himself. Or they'd kill her. Hired me to kill him. Sounds kind of roundabout to me. The kidnappers could have saved the middleman and gone straight to you. It's not that someone wants him dead. They want him to commit suicide. <laughs> Sounds like the same thing to me. But it's not. Why do people off themselves? Money problem? He's loaded. Love? He's too old for that. Guilt? He ain't done nothing. Maybe not. But suicide would sure make it look like he did. Did what? Something that's gonna happen on Friday. Uh, something that's going to happen. Get me Waterston. On a clean line. Here we go. Routed via Australia. Waterston? Sable. There's some things I need to know. Come to my apartment. No. I'll meet you below the Wolf Point Railway Bridge. Can you make it by six? Yes. Great. I'll watch for your limo. <laughs> 